Which one should I chomp up? I just can't figure out which one is greater. Wait, I can compare fractions with common numerators. The numerator is the same, so the smaller denominator is the greater fraction. I will eat 5 sixths. Yum! Hello, I'm Ali and I'd love eating the largest fractions. The more, the better. If the numerators are the same, the fraction with the smaller denominator is greater because its parts are larger. These pictures will help. The first picture shows eighths. The second shows fourths. The parts in the circle divided into fourths are larger than the parts in the circle divided into eighths. I spy some more fractions now. Six twelfths and six eighths. They have the same numerator, so the larger fraction is the one with the smaller denominator. Six twelfths is less than six eighths. I will gobble up six eighths. That was delish. Here's some more. Four sixths and four tenths. These fractions have the same numerators too so the smaller denominator will be the greater fraction. Four sixths is greater than four tenths. Yummo. That was a tasty one. Wow. There are a lot of fractions in this area of the swamp. Three fourths and three fourths. The numerators are the same, so I will look at the denominators. Wait a swampy minute, the denominators are the same too. Three fourths is equal to three fourths. Guess I get to eat them both. Wow. My belly is full. Time to go take a nap. Keep working hard comparing those fractions. <laughs>